Alright, hey guys, what's up? It's Wolf here, one and only, and today we're going to be playing some more Alchemist Code. As you guys can see, Yomi, she's kind of like nearly there. I just need two more limit breaks. Well, no, three more limit breaks, actually. Then she shall be caster, which I'm kind of farming the gear for before the bit ends. I still have this whole week to go on. Uh, we're not going to be doing the summon today. I'm going to be saving off all of my gems into the next collaboration just because... Eh, you can get these units that are coming out right now at any time. And the collaboration units, you would have to wait for the collaboration to recast. And that would be like, and that would literally be like a long, long wait, which I'm not willing to do. So, yeah. I'm just going to start saving off all my gems for now on. Instead of doing like a summon every single week, which is was insane to do in the first place. I knew eventually I'll run out of, out of gems. But we do have a new event that is ongoing, and it's called Blood Wolf by any other name, which is pretty much um, Logie's father, Zeke. So, yeah, this should be fun. He's pretty much a tank and a damage dealer, from what I know. And it seems like there's going to be three episodes of him. I was using this to farm up. That's probably not the best thing to go for. I was using this to farm uh, stage 10 of uh, the Face Day Night event. It actually works out. Not on auto, though. Not on auto. I still have yet to find a team that can actually survive auto. Even though... Eh, I did a pretty good job at it. I'm gonna go with this team. It's been a while since I used Virgos, and Virgos is actually been extremely good as of late. Um, Shenmei? Shenmei is a really, really good for clearing out units inside of stage 10. So that's why I kept her around. Like those beetles don't, or bugs, whichever the one that the hell they are, they really don't stand a chance. Uh, these places should not be like too strong. But then again, this whole event does have um, two extra dungeons. Oh, but they're not going to be one-shotted. Unless I can get Virgos up there. So he's just going to do his own thing. Okay, cool. Yeah, I knew that wasn't going to work. So what's this one? Okay, defeat all enemies. Toss is nice and all, but... Okay, they they really need to hurry up and do the whole upgrade to the UI thing so we can actually see the status effects and see if they actually go off. I really can't wait for that. That's going to help out a lot more. Oh, these guys are overclocked. Okay, interesting. Yep. Okay, interesting. That's really interesting, actually. So you want to kill these mages first. Actually, that would be... This would be a better idea. Not using Naz. Jeez. What am I trying to do? Ah. So many things I want to use, but I can't. Or should I just heal here? Well, he's probably gonna 
do another saber, so I probably should heal. I know what's going to happen sooner or later. Jeez, man, I can't reach anybody. I still need to get Jemme up to a um, better level. These guys aren't charging, so I didn't really go for them. And we will do roundhouse kick here. Alright, so this place could be a little bit difficult. But it really depends. Looks like he's going to get harder. So it kind of starts off like this. Alright, Zeke to carry him. Next, we're going to take care of these guys. Darn, I can't reach over there. Ah, fine. Oh, you almost had me. Alright, he's dead. And now we only have one more up. I'm still kind of working on um, Yomi right now. She's nearly maxed. Maxed out our um, necromancy, but eh, that was been a little bit more of a hassle to finish. Alright, that's done. Jeez, man, this whole like story in this stage kill all foes. Wait, what? Huh? I'm actually confused. Excuse me. Oh, before reinforcements. Okay, okay, I see, I see. I was about to say, what the hell do you mean? Because when I killed everybody. I could have waited until reinforcements, but you know, I guess that's fine. Clear without no continues, without healing, and with the max of four units. I can do that. Uh, let me go ahead and grab these, because we do have milestones that we can do as well. Uh, a few of his milestones are actually pretty straightforward. They're all separated too, so you can see which ones you have to do multiple times. I think I'll just aim for this just because I need it for uh, Yomi. Everything else is just meh. But let's go ahead and make him because I'm pretty sure he's a um, three star. <sighs> Gilgamesh. Why? Why do you hate me this event? Oh wait, hold up. Let's say I can make these two characters. All right, there's Zeke. Let's take a look at him right quick. And see if he needs like anything for leveling up. Oh, there he is. Nope, he doesn't need anything special to level up, so that's cool. That's really good to hear. I'm good. I'm not going to use that. Yep. 
Like I said, I'm not a big fan of him without the costume, so I'm definitely going to aim towards the costume. But let's go ahead and get into stage two. Oh, this place actually gives watches. Um, I'm pretty sure he's gonna try to retribution blade me if he has it. Oh no, he got something way different. Okay, take the wheel. I'm good. <laughs> Wait, one damage? Excuse me? Repeat? Oh, that's not good. Ah, man. Taunt is a terrible thing to go through right now. So I might need a vaccine off the start. But I would add that out speed Caesar at that point. So this is going to hurt. Yeah, of course. I kind of saw that one coming. Yeah, I definitely need to outspeed him. More or less, I need to take out these guys. take you out so you don't become troublesome and now that Shen Mei is okay oh that's gonna hurt oh never mind it's all good we avoided some damage that would have caused a lot of trouble no this way. Actually, hold on. Well, it'd be better to use this since they're facing backwards. If I could do back damage to them, um, Pierce penetration pretty much ignores defense, so that's actually pretty good. How far can I reach? No, I can't reach there. Meaning I have to be right about here. Actually, here's what we're going to do. Since I have confidence you can actually kill them. Just in case, I'm going to help out just a little bit. Oh, well then. Well, her turn's almost up anyway, so might as well do this. Alright, what are you going to do now? Are you still going after her? Okay. Uh, let's go behind. Behind. Right there.
Okay, I don't even need it. Okay, sweet. Stage two is done. I gotta say, that taunt causes a lot of issues at the beginning. So vaccine would be really nice at that point when it starts. So I might have to carry um, Michael. What is this one? No healing, clear by taking Zeke. No deaths. I don't, I'm not sure about the no death parts, but we're gonna try. Where are you, Zeke? I know you're down here somewhere. There's by rarity, at least. There you are. But we can take an extra ally, and we're going to take... Well, actually, we gotta take somebody way stronger. Just because they die pretty easy. Necromancers are actually pretty strong, so I'll bring her. Well, let's get through this last piece of story. Yeah, Zeke was definitely more of a villain than anybody back then as soon as he got the power. I can definitely say that. I can see why so many people in Raph are actually pissed at him. And afraid of him too. Well then. And that's where you met, uh, what's her face? So we're not going to talk about the hero woman? No? Okay. So this is how Zeke turned that around, okay. This is actually pretty interesting.
Um, probably. This should be fun. Oh, dear God. What is up with all the powerhouses we're going to have to fight? <laughs> Everybody's been like pretty much Dark Knights or Holy Cavaliers. Not Holy Cavaliers, uh, Dark Cavaliers. Pretty much hard hitting one shotters. Ah, uh, well. Alright, so... She was pretty much more of insane than anything back then. Okay, cool. Great, great to know. All right, then. Let's go ahead and uh, take out the crazy chick. <laughs> oh, God, this video is going to be nearly an hour. That's gonna be fun. Oh yeah, she's poisoned too. She's probably still gonna be a hard hitter. So I gotta be careful. Oh, I can't leap yet? What? I can't hit her with that. And I hate to admit it, I don't think I can do this either. Yep, because the game doesn't tell me if that would succeed or not. Hmm. I didn't know that's what that weapon did. Excuse me. Oh, that's not gonna work. Oh, dear God. She has a lot of HP, actually. I wonder if we're just supposed to stay away from her until she poisons herself to death. That could also be a thing. Oh. Holy crap. Okay. That's cool. What are the conditions for this? Without healing? Excuse me? You want me to do this without healing? Okay, you're insane. You're actually insane. Like... Come again? You know how many of these guys can actually just finish me off here? Hmm. How would I approach this? No, don't do that. Yeah, I probably cannot. That's a lot of HP she has. That's actually pretty insane. We have to think of something. 
Oh, actually. If I start here, one, two, three, four, five. Oh no, actually one more step and I actually could have drained her. Hmm. Trying to figure out something, a strategy or. Yeah, I don't think that's gonna work. That's unfortunate. Well then. This is gonna be difficult to try to uh, figure out. This should be fun. I don't want her to have too much. Good job. That's that's what I was hoping for. Good freaking job. Um, I might actually try it without no healing. says no deaths too so I'll just do a separate runs if anything are you kidding me I hate that I can't reach you I guess that's fine mm, that probably wouldn't be the best choice either because if I take too much, she's literally going to just sit there and uh, try and drain. So. Huh. Can I hit any of these guys? I think I can, actually. Actually, if I was caster, I could literally run up here and... Uh, do the days and bind, bind so they wouldn't be able to move or do anything. Oh, that's unfortunate. <laughs> if I was caster, this would be amazing. But I cannot, unfortunately. And if I was to a blood temple, that I'm pretty sure that would cancel out everything too. Oh, they wouldn't even take that much damage anyway. Ew. Man. This is actually quite something. Maybe I just need a light damager. Yeah, I thought that was coming. Actually, when I think about it, we could actually do this. If I put the strongest tanks I have as helpers, instead of um, starting them out to where they can get hit, once the next person dies, I could just switch over to the next. Yeah, why did not I do that? I'll just put Zeke inside of the team. And that's a kill. Interesting though. Like really interesting.
like we should we could actually slowly do some damage to her so i'm gonna actually try it that way and we'll see how that works yeah this is literally like an hour recording i think next week we'll do the extra dungeons because this is going to take like way too long and i don't want to like a extremely long video but i guess it's unavoidable <laughs> considering the story is actually pretty long too I mean, we could revive as well, but I don't think this one allows revives. Yeah, no continues. All right, so. I know it says do it with Zeke, right? Yeah, clear with Zeke to get this. Okay. So here's what we're gonna do. Zeke in the main squad going to take you out well actually we don't need to take you out you're arranged so what we're gonna do is do we really want to take her out hmm. actually what we're gonna do put you in that way you don't get hit by the start off damage that she does maybe there's something that triggers it that's what we need to be more concerned about we can also take snipers as well just so we don't have to get up close and personal too much um who else who else We really don't have any like really defensive people who could just like protect from one attack at the start. So that's also an issue. But two rangers, I don't think that's gonna work, but we're gonna try it. If not, we'll save it up for another video. Because this one is getting rather long. Or I'll just keep going and just skip the other attempts and then we'll just skip on to the one where I actually defeat them. work yeah, I can't reach her right now no no it's the whole area she does it so there is no escaping it Interesting. She just has like one big radius. It's actually insane. Jesus. So range characters aren't going to work against her. I thought I could be a little bit sneaky, but yeah, apparently not. That's unfortunate. Actually, no. She works just fine against her. How much damage can I do to you guys? Pretty decent. But nothing like extremely amazing. Got him so far away. I'd rather weaken as much as I can.
dead. Both these two are probably dead too. Oh no, just her. All right, here's where it begins. You start doing damage to you guys. Let's see if this strat works. Actually, oh. I can windmill these guys if she chooses to fight her. Okay, cool. That saves me off another round. No, stop moving. Just stay right there. Ah, thanks for ruining my plans. And that's going to hurt. Jesus Christ. They have so much damage, it's insane. And you're dead. Oh my god. Really? Do we really have to chain? Keep your combos to yourself. And he's dead. Great. <sighs> Saw that one coming. That was like really predictable. I mean, I have like a good idea going. It's just that it's pretty hard to execute. Especially without healing. That's like really weird. But we got rid of her. Like, I don't really know what applies to not healing oh and plus they have reinforcements so yeah this is impossible for me i'm literally just going to heal there's no point in trying that i'm pretty sure these items are actually farmable too for this area pretty sure his shards are farmable so there's no point in trying to do this challenge you can't succeed on like every last one of them to be honest Especially where I am. Uh, no, it doesn't look like his shards are farmable. It looks like you have to actually fight every single thing and get his shards. That's actually very dumb. And I dislike that method. Hmm. No deaths. Healing. You gotta be kidding me. You know what? Screw it. We're just gonna we're just gonna skip all all those like challenges and keep going. I kind of want to know what happens at the ending, so I'm gonna go ahead and skip on ahead for you guys. So I'll see you guys there. Of course, she's gonna steal. All right. So that's a big no-no, and something we don't want her to have. She's gonna have to stop that. I think our rangers will be just fine. As long as we don't see a certain line, I guess they don't move. Or it just takes them a little while. Yeah, there's no point in me bringing Karis. She can't do damage. Go right here, thank you.
All right, sweet. Now you can attack. Actually, that's perfect. We have her over here isola isolated a little bit, so yeah, that could work out. Could. Ah, oh, I can't get behind her. That's annoying. I want to keep you from using anything as long as I can. I wonder what else would work. Would silencing or something work? God darn it. Why do you have to be there when I need... <sighs> oh boy, oh boy. Can I do it from here? Okay, cool. Jesus, Lucian. Hey, um, can you guys pay attention to this guy right here, you know? He wants to fight you. I knew that's who you're gonna go for next. Oh, you don't gain back a lot to be honest so we actually could use it use that to advantage sometimes She's dead. No more I have to worry about her, but the reinforcement should come in like really soon. Which is fine. Holy crap, bro. Chill. And he's... Oh, no, he's not dead because he, he has to... Oh, I don't know. Actually, he's going to be dead because of that. God darn it. I wish you guys be such a pain in the rear end. Can I? Okay. No, I can't go down there. I'm actually going to do this. Just because if I was to windmill, I would not have any enough jewels to fit off myself from them. Oh dear God. Um, I guess I'll take out this guy. I'm gonna try to use her as bait. Hopefully she does um, evade hits. Oh, so we're just doing like a fire range here. Is that how you guys feel about me right now? Alright, no more out of you. Holy crap. Nope, no, 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 no. Alright, what can we do here? We can make them chase. And we can put them in uh, Yami's vision. And we can start doing this now. Or we can do this. We can do that twice, actually. Pfft. 
Yeah, good luck with that. I just need a few more jewels off of you. And that's our last one. I do apologize, I can not like, do all the challenges for you guys. Like always, on this channel, we don't go for, like, full completions. I mean, we attempt, we try and attempt it, but most of the time, we don't actually succeed. Since this is more, like, just an average player friendly. Friendly more of gameplay. Just because I'm not a well player. Let's just say it's non-well experience. This is the things we have to deal with. Alright, and you're pretty much out. So, GG. As long as we finish everything and get to see the end of the story, I'm good. I don't really care. <laughs> the finish is a finish. Alright, now I can take out Z probably use somebody way useful I'll probably look up somebody else who done it I'm pre pretty sure Yushi has probably um, finished it so I'll see if he's done it limited to Dias and excuse me oh this is just look collect treasure what what so it's pretty much like the um, Christmas event is what I'm getting at there Okay, well then. So, where is my Diaz? Anybody else running Diaz here on oh, my friend list? I gotta remove these guys. No reason of having them. This is team two anyway. Doesn't really have anything good. Okay, cool. So you can bring a mercenary into here and just go into this room. Alright, so the story ended off pretty weirdly. <laughs> It was actually pretty interesting. Alright, collect all the treasures before time runs out. I can do that. Treasure hunting master here. I'm not sure if these guys are like really strong or anything. If it's like the Christmas event, they're not strong. Pretty sure somebody else is killing them too. Or maybe... No. Oh. These guys only have 5 HP, so it's like 5 attacks. Oh! Okay. Since he's taking poison damage, we only got that amount of time. And god darn it, why is my, why is my movement so low? So that makes a lot more sense. So anytime it hits his turn, his HP goes down. We got plenty of time. As long as they're not coming over here trying to block me, it's all good. So they have pretty much a set route. It's a good thing I sent the other guy that way. Because I do want my stronger units to be this. Okay. Really? Really now? Okay. So we're going to have to deal with that. That's a big no. Um, 
Oh, you can't even kill them. They have way too much HP. Who? <laughs> How would one even do such a thing? <laughs> oh, I do have these. Okay, cool. Wait, is this the status effect ones? I wish I can hold it down and actually see, but apparently we don't get that luxury. Is that the one? Yes, it is. Hey, struts. Don't even worry about it, guys. You guys actually know what to use now. Hey, you can stop that, please. Oh, they have no defense, too. There's no point in using it on him. He can't go anywhere. I think he has one more life, right? Yeah. And his turn's coming up, so... Kind of missed the opportunity to get the last three. Hmm. I wonder what I can do to get the last three. I guess just increase their agility. I guess they're expecting them to be max level. But that was pretty straightforward. Oh, you get a lot of um, XP for it too. All right, not have bad of an event. Now, where are the extra? Oh. There's more. Agatha, that's what it was. That's her name, I kept forgetting. I'm kind of stuck on the texture, you know, bugging the hell out of here. Oh, well then. Yeah, nobody gets second servings on this table. Well, the, nobody gets sick of service at this table, like I said. Everybody starves. <laughs> Alright, this was a pretty interesting event and story. I definitely enjoyed it. So that's the end of it. Now we get the extra dungeons. It didn't say nothing about the fourth episode. But I, get, I just kind of assumed since there were only events for it, so... Yeah. Maybe now and then they'll sneak in a little bit of a extra episode 
And I should probably finish that one too, just to get that extra gold, because that's actually a lot of gold through that quest. Do make sure that your DS and Logi are actually pretty decent level to where they can outspeed um, the other enemies. And make sure to carry anything that removes status effect. So, yeah. As long as you're stationary, which they pretty much force you to stationary. And once you take out the effect, you can move forward. Alright, there's the extra dungeon, which we'll do uh, pretty much next week. Yo! Her stuff is here already. Ew. Oh no. Um, is she gonna have the same reach as the other insane ones? I'm pretty sure I have her already, right? If I do, I'll work on her. Oh yeah, I do. That's gonna be fun. Yay. <sighs> what well, another character to add on to the list that I have to actually work up. Oh dear god. I have to get her to 75. That isn't happening. Nope. But I hope you guys enjoyed. I'll see you guys next time on the next video. Till then. Peace out. So let's get into a story. I'm surprised they, have, they actually have story with this with all the other ones. For what I read, you do get Zeke's um, young costume for getting him to level 70. Alright, we already know about the trio. Because they were around when the game had first started. They're in like, pretty sure chapter one, around the beginning. Oh, when Diaz was actually sane. <laughs> That's true. So why are we starting here? I thought we we're gonna start back like way further when he was a uh, when he met a uh, what's her name? God, I forgot her name already. Let's just say she's pretty much the sister of these two. Let's go with that. <laughs> oh, oh yeah, you jinx that like really hard.
So I think we are gonna go meet her. Mostly because she doesn't seem to be around at the moment. confused okay never mind never mind actually this is around the beginning of the actual story when the game starts it's around when Logi and um, Diaz fight uh, Vlad then they summon the snake guy and then we have to fight him so yeah, it, it's pretty much the beginning. So they already saw the sister. We're not like way, way in the past where he um, pretty much destroyed rap, I'm pretty sure. Oh, but he's going to talk about his past. Okay, cool. That clears up everything. <laughs> say Zeke looked like a badass back then. You know, he kind of still looks like it now, but he looked way better young. So I'm hoping to get a skin. I'm definitely going to be working on him as much as I can. You can also get his sword in this event too. So I definitely recommend grinding for him. I mean, he's a free unit and he's actually pretty decent. I don't think he's like extremely powerful, but he is pretty much a hard hitting tank since he has um, Holy Cavalier and Dark Cavalier. Yeah, that's the snake dude. Yeah, that's why I was thinking it was the ice snake. looks a lot more normal without the whole you know crack in the face going on definitely like his armor better than um, normal units
All right, this is what I was talking about. The armors kind of do look kind of similar. I was going to say this armor is still pretty sick, but with the symbols on it, yeah, I'm kind of leaning toward, towards the normal units again. <laughs> Oh, well then. Considering Zeke is still... Well, actually, he's not alive anymore. Hmm. Considering he lived that long, let's say that. This guy must have died in some type of way that I'm actually pretty curious about. So I'm pretty sure Zeke was the one who defeated them all. Also, he even control other people. That kid, that's actually pretty interesting. I'm still wondering why this guy isn't an actual character along with uh along with uh Vlad and the other dude. So I'm pretty sure they missed the chance to actually really, like put these guys in the game to be able to be used just because so many units in the Japanese version outshine them if they were to come out. Unless they actually still have plans for them. Or maybe I'm just missing something, you know. You guys can correct me if I'm wrong on anything in this video. Oh. So I'm thinking somebody did come in and like save him maybe? Oh no. He made Ouroboros. Whichever way you pronounce it. Uroboros.
Hey, didn't he say he lost control once? So maybe we get to see him lose control. Well, actually not actually see him lose control. We'll probably just talk about him <laughs> lose control. Yeah, you'll basically stop the bloodshed by shedding more blood. <laughs> basically how that goes. You know what? I honestly think Ouroboros is just doing this just for the entertainment of herself at this point. <laughs> Pretty sure she said it inside uh, Burgos's like story. I think she talked about it, just being entertained with it, or just deserving. I mean, she basically said she was a deserver. Guess she just likes to make things more interesting. Oh, damn. I mean, it's reasonable considering his past of what we basically heard about Zeke. Which actually turned out to be true when most of us kind of thought it was lies when that story had first started. But, yeah, kind of shifted towards it being... <laughs> that it actually happened. Alright, Caesar, that's who it was. I was trying to think of the third one.
Yeah, that is kind of, kind of true. You already have like a bad image. Don't want to force any more onto it. We're going to talk more about his past. Okay, cool. they actually were framed but I kind of doubt in it considering it's wrath out of everything Savage back then. I man got no care in the world. Please, please, no. Make it go away. Alright, I'm good. I mean, kind of true. If he did start the war, then that uh, really doesn't change anything at that point. Yeah, okay, I can see kind of where Zeke kind of fell off. Like, he's doing basically everything Diaz was doing. Well, actually, when you turn that around, Diaz was doing everything that Zeke was doing in the past that was wrong. Trying to end the war and using the power the wrong way. But I'm pretty sure Zeke smartened up from that. That's well he was uh, before he died.
Oh, so that's the name she had. <laughs> or the little nickname Caesar gave her is Bloom. Okay, well then, this story is actually getting pretty interesting. I've always been wondering what happened to Zeke's past, and now we actually get to look more into it. I'll probably look up somebody else who done it. I'm pre pretty sure Yushi has probably um, finished it, so I'll see if he's done it. Oh, Blue Knight. That wasn't even the nickname. <laughs> okay. Oh, okay. Well, good thing you didn't have to use the power. Ah, uh, you. I wish you would die already. I hate you the most. Like, nobody figured out that this guy is just sketchy, man. Always been sketchy, will be sketchy. Never will not be sketchy. Yeah, sure. Sketchy, man. Sketchy. It's gonna get better real soon. Don't let anyone tell you what you should do. I got a clear view. We're gonna make it soon. Just keep pushing through. Yo, what you got to lose? Yo, what you got to lose? Yo, what you got to lose? Just keep pushing through. Cause what you got to lose?